Welcome to another installation of our videos. Well, you've always heard Josh mention that Nico speaks with a Dodecanese European accent. Actually, my voice is a Dodecanese voice, but my accent, I was told, is from the Orange Free State. Anyway, enough said. I'm now going to demonstrate how we can install Nextcloud in Docker. I have a Proxmox server. Inside there, I created an LXC container. And inside there, I installed Docker. If you are not familiar with how to install that, we've provided a link down below to show you how to make that installation. And then inside that Docker container, I'm now going to install Nextcloud. For the instructions of this video, we've created a blog page and provided you with a link down below to that blog page. Enough said, let's get our hands dirty. I have just started that LXC container and let's open it in the console. Right, and we've logged in and we created our LXC container is an Ubuntu 22.04 server. This gives us long time support. The first thing I need to do is to create my folder. So let's run this command. We've now created the folder. Now we want to go to that folder. CD plus OP stacks. That's it. Right, this is an empty folder. With this command, we are going to create our Docker Compose file. Notice that it's compose.yaml. That's the new standard for Docker Compose. And I will now copy from my blog the content and put it in here. And then it's control S to save and X to exit. Now that we've done that, we can run this. When you are working with a new compose file, normally you would say docker compose up forward slash D to run this in detached mode. like that. However, when you are working with a new Docker Compose file, you may not want to run this in detached mode so that you can see if there are any errors or any issues. So let's run it and we can see in the terminal what happens. Of course, doing it this way, you are going to get more verbose output in the terminal, but that's really what we want. Right, this is a good sign. We have now opened Dockage and we can see that this is running. And guys, there you have it. We have installed and we have a running next cloud. And now let's create our admin account. Admin. And now we have succeeded to install and to get Nextcloud to work. As you can see, this was a very easy installation to do. We trust you found this interesting. Please give us a like. Tell us what you would like to see in the next video. And please subscribe to our channel as we haven't reached our target yet. And with that, we say goodbye. Adios. Yes, you feel it. Tot sins. Sayonara.